right. Looks like we got the full group here. Man, right. Casey looks sharper than I do, too. Everybody's wearing a suit today. Yeah. Yeah, I just figured because I got that uh, that big murder thing today. So Yeah, make sure you're on Outlook and you've got your calendar pulled up because we're just going to go over the next couple of weeks. And on the Outlook it, Cal, right? The Outlook Cal, not the G Cal? Not right, the Apple yeah, Cal? Yeah, that's right, Outlook. I'm doing paper. I'm okay. doing paper Cal. Yeah, if you've got your giant desk calendar, that works too. Great. Because April, you were saying that last time we wanted to switch over to to G Cal, but I didn't want to import. April, but, did you tell him that? No. Okay. Well, okay, that's kind of weird. I'm You'll sure she did. I'm court. sure she didn't tell him. I think he's just embarrassed. No, yeah. no, no, that's that's. If we were in court right now, that'd be perjury. So let's um let's okay. keep going. Well, you be in contempt. Yeah, and guys, let's just kind of move on. So move on, Casey. All right. Hey, let's start on the 19th. And I've got Steven's case on a possession charge. Can you Can actually have Steven yeah. give me a call um, and just tell him I need a 10? I need a 10. Yeah, let, let, let's not do that right now. Okay. Um, April, you just give him a shout and confirm his hearing for tomorrow. I'll handle that one, Patrick. You're He'll good. know what I'm talking about. And which possession was it again for this case? Was it was it a drug or was it a, a weapon or was it like possess, like he, he was possessed by like a spirit? Yeah, right. Well, you, you guys should already know this because it's on the calendar. It's just a marijuana charge, though. So, well, let him know if he needs any, to, you know, hide anything somewhere to give me a call. Okay, you don't have to do that, April. Just make sure he's going to be in court tomorrow. And just you know, between us guys, uh, like I, I think he should get the chair and fry. But I understand that I, I want every one of our clients, you know, to to get you know to get off basically, no matter what they did. But between sure. us, I mean, I think he should probably um, get the electric chair or something. But wow. Yeah, that's a pretty tough stance. That's why I'm going to handle that case tomorrow. And Casey, you don't need to call him. Uh, Patrick, don't worry about doing that either. I'm going to sure. get to you and the guys in a bit. Let's just get through tomorrow, okay, though, because okay. we're taking a long time Absolutely. on just one case. Um, I have also have accountability court tomorrow afternoon. Just make sure our files are prepped so I can make sure I've switched from city court to state court. I got to say last week, I, I thought I was in city court. I was in state court and it was, I was humiliated. Yeah. I mean, that, that's a, that's a big faux pas and that looks terrible on us. Patrick. I was in a different city actually. Yeah. That's even worse. So probably you and I also need to talk well, by ourselves after this meeting. If, if that's what's happening, we should do one it on here. One. We should probably do it here. Just cause yeah. I, so I know for future too, like, you know, what the penalty is for doing something like that. Initially, the only penalty is going to be us sitting down and talking about it to address it. Absolutely. You know we do it when we hang out. We were going to hang out, so we could just do it then. That's true. Okay. Yeah, that, that's also something we can do Fishing. fairly quickly after okay. this meeting. because If we're talking about penalties and stuff, I truly hate to be like a rat. Okay. I, but I want to be honest. And Judy had taken a bunch of supplies like last time that she went to the office and I just wanted to, you know, she was bragging about it and I don't think that's right because that comes out of your pocket, Jody. I will say this, Casey, I've known Judy for a long time. Yeah, we all are. You're fairly Judy. new, so I'm, I'm probably going to lean a little bit more towards her. Okay, okay so there is some sort of, uh, you know, seniority getting away with stuff. <laughs> okay, she's not getting away with it, though. We're just going to address that in a separate venue. Uh, Casey's the only one of us who her. doesn't go to church, so let's just take everything he says with a grain of salt, right? Yeah, and it's, it's okay if you go to church. It's okay if you don't go to church. He that doesn't. has nothing doesn't. to do with it. He hates it. I, must, I think he hates church. I, I just hey, don't. All right, Patrick, I Casey, let's do this real quick. Okay. I know it's important. I know you guys want to talk about that, but again, yeah. probably a separate a venue lot of cases. because that first week back after Thanksgiving, it looks like we have four trials mm. on Tuesday, December 1st. So Casey, are you going to be handling any of those or do you I expect could take me to do them all? all? I could take them all if you want. You guys have way bigger families than I have. So let me take those cases. I have nothing in my life. Do you want to come over for Thanksgiving, man? I wouldn't turn that down. So, yes. I was kind of hoping that Bobby would let me come to her place. I won't be home. But back to those cases, I, yeah. again, I'll, I will take them. And that's fun for me to do four cases because it's the thing of like, even if two of them, you know, go well, that's 50-50 and that, that's nice. Yeah, maybe we don't give all four of them to you. you. You can certainly handle one if you want to. Quite honestly, the the easiest one's probably going to be Ray's adoption because it's literally already done. And did anybody call think, dibs? Did anybody call dibs on that yet? Not yet. It's already ready to go. I've even printed and typed the order for you. You literally yeah, yeah. just have to give it to the judge and get it signed. That's it. 
all right, so so I just take I just take the paper and I bring it to the judge and the judge signs it and I don't have to talk. That's I'm helpful. Sure it's the right one. The re- oh yeah, the right the right judge or the right paper. The right paper. And the judge is, I mean, I, you know, we all know the judge is the one that sits in the the, the top, the tall part. Right. Oh, oh, Patrick, I think you might have put something in the chat accidentally. Oh, are you chatting in there, Patrick? Oh my God, no, that you wrote, "Hey, mom, sorry, I have no. to message you from my computer. I can't pick that up." That was probably from a meeting. Boy. We'll call. Yeah, it. that was well, probably funny. From my wife was on here or something earlier because Bunny okay. Boy. Huh? Interesting. What Bunny Boy is your name? Who's Bunny Boy? If you wrote love Bunny Boy. I I don't I can't see the chat. I did a, um, I you know I don't know the chat. I don't know what that. Okay. okay. Yeah. Um. Let's let's not chat in there, guys. So Casey, you can handle the adoption. Got yeah, it. It's, it's already done. So just hand him the order. Got it. I would not let that man get that kid. Oh. Oh uh, well. Actually, we do want that man to get the kid. So oh, we're again, pro. We're pro the adoption. Pro adoption. That's right. On a different subject, do you guys know how to message direct from a computer to a a text? Uh, again, Patrick, let's maybe stay focused. Okay, yeah, absolutely. Get, yeah, just, you need to. That's not even right now. It's not right, applicable yeah. to anything that's happening. Exactly. Just a few more minutes and, and we can get back to work. Wednesday, we have Carly's case. Um, it's a custody modification. Maybe, Patrick, you can jump on that one. Correct me if I'm wrong. Custody modification is when one of the parents wants to become bionic or heart robot. No, that's not correct. What, what phrase did you call it again, though? Custody modification. Modification. So, that's okay, right. Yeah. So we're, we're well, changing. Sounds like what I said. But, it, but it's not. Well, this um, is another reason I, I think we're living in the past. I mean, that is something that should be coming up soon. So we should be prepared for it. So I don't think we should come down on Patrick for saying that. I think yeah. it's actually pretty smart. Sure. Patrick, so we, on second thought, I'm going to handle Carly's case. Okay. Sounds good. Um, yeah. You just, just, let just me know keep what you writing your briefs do. and doing Brief. those. <laughs> You said you need me to pick you up briefs? Uh, no, continue writing your briefs. Sure. You are doing that, right? Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Are you sure? Yeah. So when you say briefs, that's what you always meant, right? Yeah. I so you, yeah, yeah, I know that. Okay. So you're, you're writing your legal briefs, getting ready for your upcoming cases. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm muted. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Patrick. No. Oh, yeah, totally. Patrick, no, no, pineapple. No. Turn, I should get no. back to this. Sorry. Hey, hey, Patrick. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Patrick, now you're muted. You, you weren't before. Now you are <laughs> this. Yeah. Patrick. Hey, hey guys. What was the pineapple in response to fruit? You were talking favorite fruit. Oh, okay. I right. Think- okay. G- guys, we're almost done. I'm going to need you really to rein it in right here. That way I kind of know what you're working on and we can fill you in. If we need to take a quick call. Hey. Hello. Yeah, oh boy. This is Casey. All yeah, uh, Casey, I'm going to need you to mute if you would. Okay. Well, maybe we can turn off that video too if you're wearing sweatpants. Yeah, Bobby, we just tell me what's going on in your to-do list. Want to go through and still work on those Rocket Matter templates? Okay. Thought I had something set up on Rocket Matters, but never got a confirmation on the webinar the document template thing. Yeah. And then otherwise, my focus is vacation. <laughs> right, yeah. And were um, you, sa- you were saying you were going to Jamaica? <laughs> no, cabin. Yeah. Oh, you're doing the cabin? Oh, you're just doing the cabin. Yeah, the Tennessee Does cabin. Go into the cabin again? <laughs> oh, I, you've been there, man. <laughs> you know. <laughs> it's it's a beautiful cabin. I, I swear to God, one afternoon you caught about five fish. I, could, I caught zero fish. Pretty impressive. Which Bobby? Oh, uh, I. You know what? I'm totally thinking of a different Bobby. Yeah, that <laughs> didn't sound like our Bobby. So right. I'm not sure <laughs> whose cabin you were at, Patrick. But I was thinking of a different Bobby. Yeah, different Bobby. Okay. Just a quick question to that. So yeah, when somebody's you. out of when somebody's out of town, like let's say Bobby or or you, Jody, what is the policy in terms of using your desk? Because that means the desk is open. And if you remember at the office, I don't really have a desk. I just sort of meander. Sure. So is am I allowed to sit at your desk? Am I allowed to rifle through the drawers? You can, like, you can borrow the desk. 
Okay. You don't need to be rifling through my drawers though. Don't, don't yeah, do that. I'm not rifling in a snoopy in like, I'm trying to snoop on you way. Sure. I'm just, I just mean like okay. when you're just getting settled, you want to make sure that the space is yours. Well, well, it's not yours. You're just borrowing it for the day. Don't start making changes and, and setting up permanently. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, I just want to make sure you understand that. And if you come into the office, don't wear sweatpants. I, I did notice that when you popped up. Okay. We are almost done. Jeez. April, if you would, if you'll go to Monday, please. Supposed to be having a meeting with the DA's office on LaPorsche's case. And hey, oh. Um, oh uh, we're having an issue Pat here. Yeah. Patrick, what, what's what Patrick, is going do you on? Know that, do you know that you're sharing your screen right now? What? Yeah, Patrick, you need to stop. What are you doing? Oh, that's so weird. That's so weird that I don't even know. Okay. Sorry. Stop. Okay. Um, Hi, guys. Google. I want to see pictures of flowers. Do you, do you write hi, Google, every time you, you Google something? Yeah. yeah you, guys, we have, we have an issue we're going to have to address. Um, okay. Patrick, we may have to cut back on some of this virtual presence and virtual working because it doesn't seem like you're really focused a whole lot today. So um, I won't do it again. I'm going to be uh, honest, Jody, and I hate to throw Judy under the bus again, but I could sort of see in the reflection of her eyes that she's playing spider solitaire. That That's simply an assumption. We actually saw Patrick not paying attention because he decided to share that screen with us. It, it just feels a little sexist that you keep, you know, harping on Patrick. Yeah, well, Patrick and yourself, Casey, quite frankly, are the only ones that seem to be not paying attention a whole lot. So we're, wow. we're going to, yeah. We're going to okay. deal with that and we'll, we'll get back to it. Okay. Let's just, I'm gonna deal Patrick, with your... you're going to have to stop. Honestly, this What's is, that? you're going to have to get, get off of spider solitaire. Oh, stop I... Googling. Okay. I'm sorry. I shared it again. You're sharing the screen again. Yeah. Sorry. Just stop doing it. Let's focus up so that we could break right. for lunch. <laughs> yeah. We need to do that. Last thing on the agenda, like I said, is that meeting with the DA's office. I still need one. I know we've been calling weekly. Is there a status on that, Judy? Have you heard anything back? I had lunch with the DA yesterday. Oh, good, good. I was going to say, know we I, slide, I just slide in his DMs, and that's usually the best way yeah. to get in touch with him. Yeah. Okay. Which DA? I, oh, uh, um, Frank. Frank. Okay. Well, luckily this is not Frank. We're trying to get in touch with. It's, so. it's the other one, right? It's yeah. Um, it's the other one. What's his name? Um, uh, I'm blanking it, on it because I know his Twitter name. Okay. And I usually will slide in the DA's DMs, and that's okay. usually how I get in touch with him. Probably not the best way to do that, Casey. You don't need to be sliding in anybody's DMs when you're doing it for the firm. Okay. Okay. So we're going to talk about that next too. I have a list of things you need to talk to me about. Yeah, uh, yeah, both of you should. We've got our Santa Claus event the first weekend in December. Great. Yeah. I love this. Um, keep in mind, too, you know, with COVID-19 kind of going on. Yeah, well, I it. heard Santa got it. Yeah, well, uh, not our Santa, luckily. One of Santa's helpers is going to be okay. coming down. It no, will be I read in the Times that Blitzen passed away from, from <laughs> it. Speaking of the charity, the charity and Christmas stuff coming up, it would be yeah, fun to do a thing where we get people to donate money, right? Like a raffle almost. Okay. And then we figure out a way like with like legal loopholes to keep half. So a half we get to split the six of us and the other half we could donate. And we just, you know what I mean? We just put it in the fine print. No, we're, we're not going to do that. It's we're, we're it's, not gonna... it's, it's sort of this thing where we didn't, but we say we didn't, we, you know, we said it. It's, you didn't, it's in the it's fine gonna... print. Casey, Casey didn't, we, didn't we all donate money to like a charity you founded? Yeah, that's why. That's what I mean. It's, I did that and it works. And nobody, the, nobody knows. It sounds like we've got some issues we need to address. I have a courtroom etiquette question. Okay, sure, Casey. What do you have? Has, has this ever happened to you, Jody, where you're in the courtroom and the courtroom is like freezing cold? I don't know whether to just walk out, get a jacket and put on the jacket or raise my hand and ask for them to put out in the heat. So I'm kind of like stuck between two worlds. Like, I'm not sure exactly like, because sometimes those courtrooms are freezing. Yeah. Um, one, one winter, I made the mistake of buying a winter coat that looks exactly like a judge's robe. And I put it on in that courtroom and he was furious. Yeah. And weirdly, my gloves kind of look like gavels. Yeah. And it was a, a big problem. Yeah, don't don't wear that jacket in court, Patrick. Casey, I mean, that actually is a decent question. You can always speak with one of the bailiffs, and they're pretty good, actually, about yeah. adjusting that temperature. Right. Last time, he let me borrow his jacket, so that was helpful, too. But it, always be he respectful. He left a gun in it, too. Okay, well, that, oh, that okay. shouldn't have happened. But maybe don't talk to that bailiff again. We don't want you walking around the courtroom with a firearm, because then Scary. you're going to get arrested. I can get myself off. No problem. 
I have my doubts. Does anyone have any questions? What's the dealio on? with the Christmas party? Are we oh, going? Yeah, what is the dealio with that? Yeah, we're still going to have a Christmas party, um, and all of our families are invited, of course. And okay. it sucks. We just <laughs> well, not for all of us. We we love. Our I feel family. like people don't go as ham when they have their family there. They don't go ham. It's nice when the office staff like gets together and everyone can kind of just like get trashed and like say things and it's like none of us want that anymore we don't want a vodka and pinatas that's actually a good point patrick i'm gonna keep setting up the christmas party casey you don't need to plan anything later anything else on the agenda anything at all from anybody um i had an idea that i wanted to sort of brainstorm with everybody i was thinking it would be kind of fun to drive in front of people slam on the brakes get hit i'm the victim and I'm also, you know, I could represent myself. And I feel like that's an easy windfall. We're not going to do that. That's unethical. I've heard you mention that before, and it needs to stop. Well, what if I steal a car and hit him and then do a hit and run and we oh. hit yeah. it on the car? Yeah, Patrick, guy. That, that's fraud. We're not going to do it. Uh, and the fact that you two even think that's it's an a victimless crime. Me yeah. a little bit. Also, Jody, no bad ideas. No bad ideas. We're just, op- we're just spitballing. We and seriously it- need to talk after this meeting. Okay. Um, okay. So after this meeting, you know, me, you, Judy, and Patrick will let the three of us know what we did wrong. Well, I'll let you and Patrick know what you did wrong. Judy, Bobby, April, thank you. you and have fun in Jamaica, I Bobby. End, I don't want to end the meeting on a negative note, but this was a huge waste of time, honestly, Jody. No okay, offense. Okay, Patrick. We'll, we'll talk in a few minutes. Okay. okay. Thank you I, all. I love you. Love all you, right. Jody. I love you, Jody. I love everybody. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Thank you guys so much.